はい、お待ちどうさまです。竹岡式車種弁です。ありがとうございます。So that was ramen raburu,、uh, which serves a takeoka shiki ramen style that is famous in Chiba. It's actually a really local ramen style.、Um, and they serve it here in Sangenjaya, in basically the heart of Tokyo, you could say, or really close to it. And、um, it's really, really interesting style because it breaks with a, a couple of、um, things that you would assume ramen to have. And、uh, this one, especially. Doesn't actually use any soup. Instead of soup, they just use water to fill up a really strong shoyu tare with a lot of MSG. You actually see the guy、uh, ladling some extra MSG into the, into the bowl. And、um, they use something、um, like a mother tare, like a, a, a tare that they use、uh, day and day again that they prepare.、Um, Not only once, but basically, they, they keep using the same tare. So it gets like over time a kind of like burnt barbecue ish flavor that is、uh, really hard to replicate if you just started、uh, today and wanted to prepare this from scratch today. Really difficult to imitate. You basically have to go to a place that has been around for years and years to really get this、um, unique flavor that only develops over time. And on the noodle side, they use very thin noodles that work really well with the, you know, not so、um, rich background with, I mean, without soup.、Um, the chashu is marinated, I think, in the same tare that they use for、um, the soup. And、uh, you get like a really, really strong flavor. It's、uh, definitely different from other chashu that you get because it is really deeply penetrated with a really salty. Shoyu tare. So, you have to be really a shoyu, a soy sauce fan to enjoy, enjoy takeoka shiki ramen. Another、um, part is the raw onion cubes that you see on top. They work really well with like cutting through the saltiness to the、um, kind of sharp flavor of the, the, the soy sauce、um, in that bowl. And it just goes to show once again that with MSG you can fix everything.、Uh, you can even omit making any kind of broth or soup、um, and just straight up mix water, soy sauce, and、uh, MSG, and you get some passable ramen.、Um, it's a really interesting style that has been mixed in. For example, if you check out my video about、uh, Stamina Ramen Suzuki, they cite this style as one of their inspirations for their bowl, and you can definitely taste that. That、um, it alludes to this one. And、um, yeah, personally, I think this is a really cool、uh, piece of, of ramen history.、Um, and you can get it right here in Sangenjaya, just a couple of stops away from Shibuya. A real unique bowl of ramen here. For me personally,、um, I think definitely I would be in the mood for this、um, from time to time. So I'll give it a good 7.5, I think. It's very specific. 
Um, I'm sure there's people who absolutely love it, uh, are into these kind of more nostalgic styles of ramen. So I'm sure it will find its fans. And uh, yeah, that's all from me today. Check out my videos, click like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.